Welcome back to another mine, this time with El Vibrato stuff, it seems like. Um, abandoned mine cultist camp, okay. Look at the spiral, makes you feel queasy. So we had the one place before where there were a bunch of people there and they'd all gone mad. The, the note says, Dear Jeff, got called up north to deepest delve. See you soon. Praise be Roberto. Sincerely, Jeff. You don't like this one bit. Shelf containing an, an effectively infinite amount of sarsaparilla. You're never sure how to spell this and you still aren't. You hate the spiral. This place seems poorly ventilated for a campfire. Maybe that's why no one's here. There's no way this whole thing... Well, I mean, I guess it could be just here to tell us to go to... What's it called? Deepest Delve? Which is, I'm guessing is one of the places that I saw in the diagram on the map before. Okay. We still don't have a... Yeah, we don't have a cart. Okay. So I can't do anything there. Interesting. The switch is long since rusted away. Not that it was useful. Oh. Gonna have to fight these snakes to get through here. Okay. No, they're not too bad. Okay, strong medicine. It's a big buff. Um, shoot a bunch of targets. That's unfortunate. I don't really know how the whiffing works. But, all right. Please don't want, don't, don't all, oh, you're all gonna do it. Okay. It's like your dad always said, up two snakes in a mine, feeling fine. Three snakes in the dark, no walk in the park. That's an insane thing to say, Dad. Hidden effect, angry. Should have listened. Alright. Time to start um, consuming consumables. So. What do we want to consume? Because I don't have a lot of, um, I don't have a lot of, uh, XP left. I basically spent all of it on getting up horn swoggling when I did that. So, um... One more damage. Hmm. Oh, this one, it does more shots. Strong medicine, good medicine, okay. So, I, yeah, I don't know. Mm. Mm. I mean, the more shots, the more chances. It's still not always the best option, but... I don't know, it's not like it costs a lot of XP. Um, but we also still need to take some items. Really wish any of this was sorted. We're gonna assume the things near the top are the better ones because they th seem to get better as we've gone on and then the ones near the top are the newest. Can I use this? No, okay. Well, 
What is my armor right now? I don't I don't even know. Oh, my spleen can take three I can take six now. Why is that? I have an item that's doing that? Maybe it's something else? Potionology? No? I think it must either be something I'm wearing or otherwise I don't know. I don't suppose any of these are going to be... buff would be too bad. Um, I don't know. I don't know what's going on with, uh, with that. Haven't looked at all my gear in a while. I'm not going to do all of it right now, but I'm just double checking there isn't something obvious that would really help me out. The large plush cat is actually quite good. Is it better than the horseshoe? I don't really know. I don't know how those math, that math equals out like I showed when we did that testing. Um, let's give it a go. Wait, they give me speed. I don't really care about that. Everything else is kind of a, a wash. I could take the miner's pants. Still don't know what my armor rating is in the first place. Speed determines first combat. I've literally never gone second, so I don't know. I don't know where my armor is even shown. Oh, there it is. Armor six. So I actually, hold on, how much did that give me? So I only had four. And it was all coming from these boots. Problem is I don't know how much how armor really even works. I don't know if it's just flat damage reduction or what. Um, I'm not doing anything that gives that requires me to use my muscle. I don't suppose any of these others. Wait a minute. Yeah, that still gives more moxie. As long as I don't care about damage type, which I don't. I could go with some extra health. Probably make me survive at least the first round. I mean, frankly, if I can't survive the first round, I don't know how I'm gonna survive subsequent rounds anyway. Ugh, this is, this is tricky. Um, so my spleen can take quite a bit more. brought a seltzer is very good. I don't actually remember where I got it. Did I pick it up or can I craft it? Increases all your stats by five and your maximum AP by two. I mean, that's strong.
I think that beaker of lemonade is going to be one time use only. I don't think we can go back and make a second one. Um, Blood Demon Cow, that's probably the thing that'll like give, probably give me the same warning as reading the, the Necro book. Let's see... Just ranch dressing. I think I bought these tonic, the tonic and the moisturizer. Did I buy those off the guy in dirt water? All right, regardless, 25 extra HP is a good idea. Drink the oil and feel your, feel your liver swell with pride of how swollen it is now. Patently livered. Actually not a lot of these that are a really good idea. I don't know if I can double up on them either. Armor by five is probably a good idea. You uncork the laudanum and spill most of it on the ground before drinking the remainder. It's just as well the whole bottle would definitely have killed you. You gain an effect laudanum. Oh, good then. Um... Should I just go for a seltzer? No, let's um, let's look. Oh no, I don't want to open my browser because it might auto play something. Let's look up on my phone instead, real quick. Um, how do I get more El Vibrato seltzer? Let's see. Chest and secondary storage converted from El Vibrato fluid by the machine in El Vibrato chamber. Sometimes found in El Vibrato caches. So it sounds like it may not be. Yeah, I think that's a very limited thing, if it's even replicatable at all. Um, I think we'll leave that for now. Just notice... Okay. Can I double up on these? Let's see. Did that? Yep. Did, in fact, let me do that twice. Okay, um, so I now have an armor of 16, which should make me, hopefully, much more resilient. Um, and I'm gonna hope that's enough. I also got like 25 more health. I honestly don't know what else I can potentially do other than burn items in the combat itself. So, we're gonna give it a go. Oh. Well, the one time that I remove my speed buffs, I get to eat my words and go second. Ah, <sighs> okay. Let me drink my strong medicine. You know, it doesn't actually say how long that buff lasts. And I was sort of under the impression that it would last the entire combat, but it kind of makes more sense if it's only for the turn. Otherwise, it's just a weird flat buff. Um, hmm. I need to guarantee kill one of them. There's just no point bandying about that. 
And I need Doc to heal me, but I don't think that's going to heal me sufficiently. But I only have three action points. This is suddenly way harder. I don't know why this got so much harder all of a sudden. It's kind of wild. So these... These usable items, including the bullets, don't burn. Let's see. Could I use the drones? Sure, but. Hmm. These don't cost AP, they only cost the item. So let me, um, let me spam heal, fix this. Let's see if poison is even effective. Poisoned for 15, but it didn't take damage. So does it not take damage until the next turn? I don't know. Uh, I gotta kill this one because if I try anything else, there's a chance of me not getting a kill. And then we're even worse off. All right, dead. Heal. Decent amount. Okay, I did take poison damage. They're still both gonna hit me, but my stats are now also higher, so it's gonna be less of a problem. This is like the first combat I've had any trouble with, which is hilarious. I mean, well, except for the one where I died. Don't think about that one. Really? Wow. Fifteen damage. It is flat, so that's a guarantee. Okay. Good enough. That's better than spending the time to heal him. These guys are tough though. Is it just Is it just their muscle level? That doesn't seem extraordinarily high. Oh. Uh, please don't do any special attacks that happen to kill me. Why is it... He's doing even less damage now. Wow, okay. Definitely dispatch the trio of serpents with your trusty knife. You managed to get the good skins off a couple of them. You got an item coral snake skin. Do, do I not have to equip that knife then to use it? Coal snake skin has been liberated from coal snake's body. Put it on your hat to add three to Moxie. Forgot I've got the add-ons for my hats as well. Uh, all right. You know, since things are are proving harder, hot resistance. I was taking less damage in that combat than the one where I died. Um, oh, right. Let's come back to the Kellogg thing. Hold on. Purify guts. Okay, uh, we'll finish this dungeon and then go to Kellogg's next time, all other things equal.